going on people and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we've got a parallel workout for you guys. We've got a beginner routine, intermediate and advanced. So pick a bunch of exercises you can do and just follow along. All right, let's get these here. All right, guys, the first exercise we're gonna get into for the beginner routine are regular, normal push-ups. Now doing push-ups on parallax are amazing because it just allows you to get into that greater range of motion. So it's gonna make you stronger in a greater range of motion. Again, switching up the grips just hits the chest and triceps from all different angles. You guys also don't have to follow this exact routine. If certain exercises you find really tricky or hard, you can always go down onto your knees or you can just pick one, two to three exercises and just master them before attempting the others. So it's totally up to you. If you're struggling to have a strict routine, then follow this exact one. If not, you can always change up the sets and reps and adjust it to your own personal needs. Moving swiftly on, if you're on the intermediate stage of training and you find those beginner exercises quite easy, then you may want to try out this routine. So we're starting off with pipe push-ups, again hitting the shoulders a bit more on traps and also the triceps, but it's just a harder uh, push-up variation. Same with planche push-ups, again form-wise you just want to make sure you have that hollow body, uh, posterior pelvic tilt, so squeeze your glutes, tense your legs and just go uh, halfway when you push up. Again L-sit hold, if you can hold an L-sit knock them out, do max holds, and if you can't do the L-sit, you can always jump into the tuck L-sit. Frog stand is again a good way to practice basic beginner balancing skills, and again it's just progressing you towards learning different skills. You don't have to actually do the frog stand as long as you're attempting them and getting better at them. Same thing with the headstand and the bent arm lever, you can always just practice these movements, and even if you don't do them, it's still good practice and it will allow you to get stronger. Moving on to the last and final one, the advanced routine. So again, this is for you, for you experienced calisthenic athletes. We've got frog stands to handstands. You've got different kind of bent arm presses, but it's very handstand focused because handstands are a great way to load the shoulders and triceps. And again, it's just transferable to all your skills. So it'll help you with the planche, handstand push-ups, um, other hard push variations. So drill your handstands. Again guys, you don't have to do the form exactly like mine, even if you topple over, as long as you're getting that press motion, that's the main key. And obviously with practice and time, you'll get clean reps. Once again, you don't have to follow this exact routine, you can again pick certain exercises you can do and just adjust the sets and reps to your own needs. And again, because this uh, routine is so intense, you may want to take longer rests so around three to five minutes rest because at the end of the day we're trying to draw skills here we're trying to build up our, 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 our strength for skills so you do want to take your time make sure the quality is there when you're doing each rep so quality over quantity guys last final advanced movements the full planche and multis i'm really happy with these holds um, i couldn't do them as long before but yes i'll leave a link in the description below for the parallels i've used in this video and also for bigger ones because i find the bigger ones are also just as good to train on so I'll leave the parallels links in the description below. Do check them out, get yourselves a pair. Let's transform your body. Let's get these Cali gains, people. Summer's here. It's time to work. Put in work, work, work. We got this. Once again, it's been your boy, Tyler from Double Beings. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, like, share, most importantly, subscribe to the YouTube channel. And I'll catch you guys next week with another video. Peace.